Hello tech people. Today we are going to make this smart internet monitor for your smart home. It displays various states of your home or office Wi-Fi connection. Let's get started. You will need only two components, an ESP32 board. Any variant will work. This is a dev kit one and a NeoPixel matrix board with 8x8 eight eight pixels. Connect the NeoPixel matrix to the ESP32 as follows. Power to 5V and ground, D in pin to GPIO4. Connect the ESP32 to your computer. Download the project from the link in the description and open it. Make sure you have installed the ESP32 boards in your boards manager and select the correct board. Now let's look at the included libraries. The Wi-Fi library comes along with the ESP32 board. No need to install that, but you need to install the following libraries. ESP ping to ping the internet server to check connectivity. Adafruit NeoPixel and GFX libraries to use the NeoPixel matrix display. Install these from the library manager. Next, add your Wi-Fi name and password here. After that, you can change the pin for the NeoPixel matrix here. You can change the maximum brightness of the matrix here. Be careful with the brightness. You should not run it at full brightness unless it is connected to an external power source. Here we have connected to the ESP32 directly, so we maintain a relatively low brightness. Next, over here you can change the interval of the ping. I have set it to ping the server every two seconds. The next value controls the fading speed of the LED display. You change this to make it faster or slower. Once done, upload the code. I have made this case for the project using black acrylic sheets. Let me put it inside the case. I am providing an external 5 volt supply and connecting it to the 5 volt pins of the ESP32 and the NeoPixel matrix. Let's power on the project. When you see this, the ESP32 is trying to connect to the Wi-Fi network. If it is successfully connected and pinged the internet, it will start a slow breathing effect and stay that way while pinging every two seconds. If the Wi-Fi was connected but a ping was unsuccessful, it will display like this. And if the Wi-Fi was not connected, the display will turn red. There you go, a beautiful Wi-Fi status monitor for your smart home. Comment if you have any questions, and as usual, a like and subscribe would be amazing.